Love this podcast? Support it and sponsor today. Simply head to OzCastNetwork.com for details. Hey everybody, it's Liam, Big Al, Andy. This is the Badcast. <laughs> and here we are at the Elephant British Pub, gathered around a barrel with a couple of drinks, doing a bad cast. In a, you know, it's cold outside. And I feel like we're in like an uh, like an island or something like that. Yeah, you know, no, like you're, you're in an Irish army. pub. We're just a couple of mates hanging out with yeah. a full production unit. That's and right. We're doing. It, we're having a great time. How, exactly. how many episodes is this? Is it like uh, almost coming out to our fortieth episode? I think it's, this might be like thirty nine. Like, well, so, I'll check right now. So, at what point, mm. uh, like normal radio stations, do we just go? It's the same shit, but we just go the all new bad cast. That's right. We <laughs> start doing. That's right. Yes, and then do it for six months and yeah. then change our logo and shit. Mm, we need to like get some best of shows happening and shit. <laughs> yeah. well, oh, I can God. tell you, boys, that. Ladies and gentlemen, this is episode 40. Is it? Oh, congratulations. This is episode 40. Yep. Congratulations, yeah, Biggie. Well done, that's, mate. That's, uh, well done. Well, just, just well for done, just uh, for the audio purposes, I think if you should hide five high instead fives, of... Uh, yeah. hand it- uh, the great uh, thing is well the episodes done. have gotten <laughs> the episodes are older than what I'll ever probably achieve. Anyway, um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's not awkward at How all. How old are you now? You're, you're getting close. Thirty nine. But no. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm 37. Mm. 37. Uh, yeah. Lots going to happen in two years. I That's could become right. slim, fatter, or whatever. Mm. What do you reckon, what's your bet? What's your, what, where are you going to put I'm your gonna money? I'm going to go myself slimmer, to be honest. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yep. Yep. So at least 130. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what was, what, all right, all right. Nots? What was your absolute maximum weight? Oh, I'm not going to tell you. Really? I'm not going to tell Ooh, you. Oh, okay. I'll tell you off air. Tell us in okay. kegs. Tell us, tell us in. Well, that's what fucking got me there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, 300 kegs over 10 years, yeah. Andy. Well, you know, if you look at the PJs or Brian's, they've got the, uh, the, you know, the, the 100 pint yeah, yeah. thing, and I've got two pints next to it. So tell me, is that 100 pints in a night or is that 100 pints over a, time, a period oh, of time? A period of time, but okay. it's 300 pints. Oh, 300. Because it's a pint, it represents another 100. How many livers have you had? Right. Uh, well, you know, just, um, oh, you know, Do- uh, D- Darren Hinch and I share. Yeah. Yeah. No, yeah, yeah. Imagine Darren Hinch's, Hinch's psoriasis, just gr- greeny well, well, brown he, he liver. One, and he, he got. Oh, you got a, you got a, got a spare a dead, one thrown he, in. Yeah, you got a dead guy. Do you reckon he would have done the whole soprano wow. thing where he would have done it like from a dude in a bath covered in ice? Oh, the, like criminal style. Yeah, like just real like underground black market style. Yeah, probably not. I actually got a lot of respect for the guy. Oh, yeah. God. Yeah, all right. yeah. Shame, <laughs> shame, shame. <laughs> Darren Hinch. Kidney, liver, uh, heart. To, to me, I was like, oh, Go I planet. It, I think it's awesome. Hey, you have to say um, something extremely awesome happened to me on the weekend. Mm-hmm. Yeah, uh, there's two <laughs> things. Two <laughs> things happened. Like, I saw my wife's boobs four Whoa. times in a row. Wow! wow. Twice wow. when she was awake. <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Wow! And yeah. I brought a new iron. Hey. Oh, I don't know what's better. You don't understand, <laughs> fellas. A branding iron. Uh, to, no. to be honest, <laughs> I, uh, um, you know. I, I've, I've, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, I did see a milk duds on the weekend and might as well brand them as my own. Yeah, well, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Whatever you get up to in your spare time is your business. Yeah, it, it's just a time of when I should be home every night. <laughs> <laughs> Eight o'clock. <laughs> as you leave. Uh, uh, no, I brought uh, an iron because I own a lot of work shirts and all that sort of stuff for yeah. the court. And um, it, it's, <laughs> it, it was a mate. Like, it was, I, I probably had one of the, you know, I'm a very heterosexual guy and I've got heaps of friends who are. Uh, you know, batting for the other team and things. What do you mean by that, Big yeah, I, What, play cricket? Yeah. They're from well, India. I had one of those Pakistan. moments where I questioned myself because I rang up the wife and go, hey, hey, babe, um, I found an iron and it's, it's really cheap. Can I buy it? And she goes, um, yeah. Yeah. I said, oh, can you make that my Easter present? <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> She's thinking you've got another family somewhere else and you <laughs> yeah. called the wrong person. And so it was from $160 down to $99. Okay, and dude, like, it's, hey, an what did, what it's an iron. What does this iron do? do? Oh, uh, okay, well, it just... Um, does it suck you off while you're doing your yeah. shit? Oh, it definitely gets the creases out of my scrotum. Oh, that's for sure. Oh, baby. 
Jesus, what has your life become? You're buying irons now. It self cleans itself way more than my fucking Artie does. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, self cleansing. And, and, and bloody Ching Lu down the corner it, of the bloody dry cleaner. It, it certainly doesn't drip like my ex girlfriend. Oh. Well, uh, you know, it's just. <laughs> So it's one of those grails. And then I, I got to the checkout and it was from $99 down to $79. I almost wow. Come, wow. I almost come in my pants. Oh, Jesus. I actually went out back and went, can you excuse me for a second? And I went and got an ironing board cover. Wow. To match it. Because you yes. had all those spe- spare extra did bones you a, lying did around. Did you get a special or was it a full you know retail value? I went home. Mm. And I ironed my shirts for a week. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. These cuffs are never look so good. Wow. Yeah. French cuffs are they? Or uh, no, 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 no. Well, yeah. Come back to me with French cuffs next time. Thanks. Yeah, what's French cuffs? They're the ones that kind of double back over, and then you put the the cuff oh. link in. Yeah, yeah. Well, Fancy ones. Well, well, normally you can just put a cuff link into these. You can. Yeah. It's I've, true. I've got a few cuff links, so I'm a bit of a cuff link. Uh, I've got. Uh, Please a, tell me you got a Simpsons one. Yep, Duff, Duff Cup. Really? They're, they're called, they're called Duff Links. I've got some <laughs> two Guinness sets of those. ones myself. Guinness, I've got Carlton Draft. Ooh, Sorry about that. Fancy. Uh, I've got ones that look like mice. Yeah. I've got iPhones. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> I've got Darth Vader. You are my father. You know, weird, weird stuff like that. Have so. you got any grown up ones? Well, like yeah, yeah, no, they get some. When you say grown up yeah. ones, are they uh, dicks no, or they do no, it? No, 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 like no, cops. <laughs> no cops. Yeah. It vibrates um, during the day. These are my sex wing cufflinks. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, they come together as one at some point. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I've got my Tony Abbott uh, ones. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Does it, no, everyone hates them. Yeah. Uh, cufflinks. Yeah, yeah right. so I love the cufflinks. Yeah. Um, Have we run out of shit stories here on the bad cast? No. We're talking about <laughs> no, no, fucking just, ironing and cufflinks. You know what it is? I just thought, you know what? I might just talk about my real life, and it turns yeah. out. Bit shit. <laughs> <laughs> have you ever tried that on stage? But I have a fucking hot wife. Yep. So everything fucking subpars that, there and I get to see her mm. boobs. Yep. Uh, well, you, when, when you've been on stage and you've yeah. had a full set prepared, have you gotten on stage going, nah, fuck it, I'm going to change and just freestyle my life? Yeah, it hasn't gone so well. What yeah, percentage okay. of stuff do you make up out of your whole life overall? Well, well on stage? On stage, yeah. On stage, it, like a lot of it is pretty much true with a little tweak just okay. to make the, maybe the punchline or – Yeah. But majority of it is actually true. Yeah. It's actually well, quite disturbing, I mean, isn't you wrote it? a whole theatre production about your uh, life. Uh, exactly. Yeah. You're, you're totally right. And it's one of those things where you just go – yeah, can, can I tell? I don't think I've told this right, but right. Um, everyone, everyone gather around. Gather, gather around, around everyone. If you're at home, gather around something. Once again, my wife's not listening. But uh, so we're, <laughs> we're, we're, we're talking about, you know, um, so we, we've got a few nieces and nephews and stuff going yeah. through that uh, awkward period of 16 age and stuff. And, yeah. you know, uh, you know, that 13 year old stage, we have to have that, you know, where their parents have to have that discussion of the birds and the bees mm. kind of thing. And uh, my wife said to me, she goes, well, the only contribution my dad gave me in the words of the, bee, the birds and the bees, right? Mm-hmm. I don't know if I've maybe discussed this before, but uh, um, his words were, he looked at me and just went, my shaver, do not use it to shave your mutters. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, now he, now, mut- and she's said, like, I don't, I don't, know. I don't have any hairs on my mut. No can I ask a question? Uh, the word mut in Germany <laughs> is that like the ch- word chin or something like that? And he doesn't understand. Vagina. Or, no, no, is he it, fully, it is, it is fully vagina. Wet. Mut. Yeah. <laughs> what is vagina? Sure is. Yeah. Sure. So, is. And she's like, why would someone shave down there? Oh God! So she's yeah. Afro. Oh, yeah. Well, oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She, she's rolling around with a bloody comb in it. Just ready now to... we're back into the sleep <laughs> of things, everybody. <laughs> let, let me just say, here. I've brought you boys back, everyone. <laughs> she's not. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. But yeah, but yeah that, that's, that was her dad's contribution to the birds and the bees. The birds and the bees. You wow. know, I, I, mine was pretty creepy. I had to go to like a school thing. I went yeah. to a Christian oh. primary school and uh, yeah, we, we, we had to go to this fucking hall and with all our classmates, with the parents as well though. Yeah. And uh, they'd had these big charts of things of, you know, dumpy looking people with curly pubes in cartoon form that you'd have to like watch them do stuff to each other 
in front, oh, of, your yeah. in front of your parents. See, so you'd see a cartoon. It fucked, man, I'm still scarred cartoon. from it, to be honest. Yeah, um, no, it was. <laughs> well, I remember a van coming around primary school and they talk about that kind of stuff. And then went oh. to high school. They, oh, so a van was driving around the schools talking about that kind of stuff. Is yeah, that what you're yeah, saying? frogs. And it was, <laughs> 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 it gave everyone lollipops. You know. Told, told everyone not to go to those safety houses. <laughs> told you I've seen your dad before. <laughs> <laughs> what were they called? Were they called a safety house? Yeah, safety house. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Were, you know what? Yeah. No, no, no. Yeah, In Trot yeah. Park, they were fucking everywhere. Were they? Was yeah, the safety yeah, yeah. house and then there was the neighbourhood watch. Ah. Oh, they the same thing. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> hey, but very geez. soon, uh, we're yeah. going to get into some reviews that people have done on the What do you hit us with, Amando? Oh, you want to do now? You want to yeah, do your little thing first? I was just going to do some radio media stuff at Ford, so I was saying, but I thought... Oh, no, you uh, you're going to do an intro for us right now. Review time, everyone. Okay. All right, this one's on a stitcher. It's yep. uh, from Smack Jack, is his username. Oh, oh very lovely. good. Hello to Smack he Jack. sounds like one of ours. Yeah. <laughs> He's given the uh, the bad cast five out of five stars. Wow. Oh, thank you, yeah. Smack Jack. Thank you, mate. Uh, his subject uh, heading for the review is called Crazy Stuff. Okay. Okay. And he says, if you can understand what these three Aussie are, s- are saying, <laughs> this is very funny. Uh-huh. Oh, it sounds like he's from Queensland. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Yep. Stereotypes, yeah. everybody. All right, let's open up some more. Here. <laughs> All right, these are on iTunes, okay? So, okay. Uh, Sinner uh, 6 t 9 z Hello to you. Great name, by the way. Well done. Uh, five stars. Oh, well done. Thank okay, you. Uh, the subject is, knocked my socks off. Laugh face, laugh face. Oh, very oh, good. All right. Uh, laugh face means a thousand laughs. How oh, does it? So 2,000 laughs, everyone. Well, yeah. well done, guys. And also there's a square here, so there's obviously an emoticon that my computer couldn't see. Very yeah, right. too sure what <laughs> that, that was. That's, all the, uh, the, uh, that's <laughs> the one where the <laughs> finger sticks up. Yeah, right. that's right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, just like that. All right. Um, and uh, this sinner says, uh, very funny stuff. Not safe for work. Uh, very, Tongue out emoticon. Well done for that for that safety message there. Yeah. Yep. So if you are on the bus, do not put it through the loudspeakers. No. Yes. Uh, we'll get to one in a sec about that. Uh, Random twenty one says laughed out loud and annoyed everyone around me. Five stars. Ah. Thank you. Uh, Thank you. Emilu eight one nine eight four. Oh, you know what? I love oh the shit! Most. She's that- accidentally put a password in the oh. username as well. <laughs> Who hasn't done that before? That's crazy <laughs> animal. <laughs> What's your PayPal? Yeah. Did you, did, is that? Did you find that and then actually write the review? No. Yeah. yeah absolutely. Does it sound like he did? Oh man. Yeah. Well, I was born in nineteen eighty four, so yeah. it all makes sense. Yeah. Right. Uh, five stars. Uh, she says this is dangerously funny. I've had to pull over several times listening to this in the car. Keep them coming, guys. Oh, very nice. Yeah. Very nice. Thank you. Yeah. Big kisses to you. I'm just going to keep reading these out, from Liam. Uh, another five stars <laughs> from South Aussie. Highly recommended. Uh, let's go to the next one. Five stars from Jono Vickers. Anyone know Jono? No. Nah, I know or, Vickers. Yeah, okay. Go on, you. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, we're searching for an Aussie podcast to have a laugh with and stumbled, stumbled upon the bad cast. It's everything you need for a great listen. It will make you laugh and sometimes even make you throw up. Great stories from a couple of mates having a great time. Sounds like someone wrote that from the bad cast. Uh, Very good. Actually, uh, we're from Canada, so fuck you, man. No, <laughs> yeah, 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 how are those <laughs> rounded boots? <laughs> uh, Glenn underscore Oz. Uh, very funny and good podcast. Keep up the good work. For, um, hashtag proud South Australian. Oh, very oh lovely. Magical. And we'll finish it off with uh, Mike Polaroid, of course. Uh, he says funny stuff. He, uh, uh, yeah, no, that's all good. Yeah, so what we'll do is that as those reviews come through every week. Uh, yeah, how how can out. people review us? Uh, you can do it on iTunes. Yeah. You can do it on Stitcher and you can do it on Audio Boom. And also just tweet us one if you want, yeah. or Instagram, Facebook it as well. Look, to be honest, you can actually text me zero four zero four zero four zero one seven nine. And uh, <laughs> <laughs> was that actually it? Was that it? Was that it? <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> just send your review. Are you expecting do me it. to uh, beat uh, that out? People, actually, do use that number. I seriously want you to text me. It's Big Al's number. It's it, personal. It is. I, I will not answer your calls, but you're more than welcome to text me. How do you anytime. know? What, what do you mean? That is hey, actually, no, everybody, I want you to know that is actually his number. <laughs> Go back, so <laughs> replay that bit. Listen to that number. I'm take not going to beat that you, out of you. his number out. 
He is going to fucking regret that shit one day. <laughs> sure. I'm not going to answer your calls, but I will answer your texts. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so what's the number again, Big? 04 04 uh, If you call in the next 10 minutes, you'll get some pair of steak knives as well. There you go. <laughs> uh, All right. I've already used them, though. Yeah, for what? Steak, you fucking... Oh, okay. <laughs> steak, All right. Well, you are South Australian, and there are barrels everywhere. Uh, was, Who uh, knows? You're, you're right. It was actually a bow for steak pie. Mm. Oh, st- mm. Stab that with your tongue. Uh, there's one last one from uh, Craig, who's a regular oh, listener. Oh, you Craig! Yes. Uh, now, when, when we released... Craig last- Simons. Yes, that's the one. Mm. Yep, just read his whole name out there. Uh, so last week when we released the episode of, uh, you know, we're at Rowan Harry's house, you yep. know, Miley Cyrus fan and all that, uh, Craig said as soon as we put it up, uh, he's in the plane back to Adelaide and frantically trying to download so he can listen to it on the plane, which is all cool. Awesome. So nice. then uh, one of us, I think it was you, Liam, uh, you wrote, make sure you play on speaker during the flight. No, actually, that's a bad idea. It probably yeah, would have yeah. because it's pretty yeah, explicit. It, it probably would be. Yep. Uh, Craig <laughs> writes back, ha ha, I did, and two Frenchies. Uh, want to subscribe so that's cool oh, thank you Craig wow, that's yeah. fantastic Vivre la France yeah, yeah hello. isn't that basic sales like trying to spin everything around in it your was favor? so close to uh, you know they heard our uh, docetone voices and got an awful tower <laughs> <laughs> oh, French jokes uh, and uh, yeah um so Liam obviously said, you know, don't play it on those speakers, but he did. He played on a Bluetooth. He went ahead and did that. And you know how people get fucking dealt with these days on planes. Oh, no. oh I'll tell you they what. fuck around. Even if you're a doctor. What? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, sure. <laughs> yeah, Can yeah, you yeah. believe that? Oh, man. Mm. Now he's suing him. Is he? Oh, of course. Yeah, why wouldn't you? Yeah. It's crazy. Oh, yeah. You, know, you know what the good thing is? I think I'm safe. Why right. is that, buddy? Because they would have looked at me and went, nah, keep him. Keep him in. <laughs> <laughs> He's already annoying to other passengers. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> in the aisle seats. <laughs> it would be pretty hard to drag someone out of a fucking seat as well from a plane. Oh, yeah. It's kind of like they're, yeah. kind of, they're lodged in there a bit, aren't they? You know what I mean? Like, yeah. you've got to get over there. And, and the aisles out. aren't that wide. Because I, no. I, I know yeah. this for a fact because I had three hostesses try to get me out of the toilet. It's like popping an avocado seed out of an avocado. <laughs> <laughs> you just like trying to gnaw that thing out. You were just enjoying the <laughs> sensation of the air vacuum of the toilet on oh, your anus. It was fantastic. <laughs> it was uh, amazing. Oh, it was it's, wonderful. It's good times. Yeah. Hey, we also, you know, just did, we, Andy did a few <laughs> shout outs there for uh, saying thanks oh, to all the people shit. giving us shout outs. So thank you guys. Uh, we, we should say a big thank you to the Elephant British Pub uh, who have been uh, looking after us since yeah. very early in the bad cast. They, they believed it was an early. They did. They've dropped off a bit, but a now they're bit. back. They're back. <laughs> but a uh, big thank you to the Elephant British Pub. About a thousand beers but on hey, tap. How about this? If you uh, send us a message on Facebook, which is the bearcast.com, um, you know, we will give you a shout out. Because if it's your birthday coming up and yeah. you want your name shouted out, yeah. let us know and we'll yeah. shout your name out and you'll be in forever. Forever. Glory on the airwaves. And yeah. It's, yeah, everyone will know how old you are because we'll just every year it'll keep coming back. So if you're reaching 40, people just forever for the next 10 years will think you're 39, yeah. which is awesome for your Tinder profile. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Indeed. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, big thank you to uh, The Elephant for uh, looking after us. Uh, this, this show is, is brought to you also by the OzCast Network. Yeah. Um, and uh, so uh, we've actually got, you know, we, you know, we're always talking about how it's tough to keep this show rolling on, but we have got a new sponsor, everybody. What do yes. we have? Which is awesome, guys. Have you guys heard of HelloFresh? Yes. yes. I've heard of HelloFresh. Yeah. Uh, they're, they're fantastic. Mm. So uh, what, I, what I believe, it's uh, that they deliver a whole bunch of stuff because I'm a terrible cook, Liam. Mm. So this is where HelloFresh comes into play. You'll Because they are going to deliver the stuff to me. Hello. Because yep. mm. I, I have no idea on what to go to the, uh, the shops and buy. So they'll deliver it. And then the best thing about it, the ingredients they send you, they'll also send you a recipe card. Awesome. So if you are on a date or you're single or even just want to impress the missus, you can just get these delivered and you can cook every night. Awesome. Unbelievable. Awesome, awesome meals. And they're very healthy as well. Awesome. Well, well HelloFresh, uh, well, let me just give you a bit, they've given me some information to tell everybody about. I was just going to say, just so, let me just say quickly, so it's perfect if you have a Tinder profile. We can actually put yeah, it in yeah. there that you are a HelloFresh member. That's and right. And they can get fed every time they come around for a you-know-what. Exactly. exactly. It's always good to, on Tinder to say that you're fresh. Yeah, exactly. yeah, absolutely. The service delivers quick and healthy recipes with all the required ingredients, including pre-portioned fresh meat, dairy, fruit and vegetables and spices, 
to homes once a week. Uh, HelloFresh offers three box options, uh, a family box, a classic box, and a vegetarian box, with prices starting from $64.95 and options of three to five meals a week. Feeding between two to five people, that's pretty handy. Uh, for customers, the flexible subscription service means that there's no minimum order commitment and orders can be changed, paused or cancelled at no cost. Check out our great new sponsors, HelloFresh, hellofresh.com.au. When you go in to make your purchase, uh, if you put the promo code in OZCAST, our uh, wonderful How network... How do you spell that? Because I've confused myself. Sure, it's well. uh, A-U-S... C A S T, Ozcast. Oh, I always put an Ost like an A U S T. Don't confuse people, Big Al. It's A U S C A S T, Ozcast. And if you do put in that promo code, guys, actually you get two times 25 bucks off the first two boxes you get. So that's pretty good. Wow. 25 bucks off the t- first two boxes you get. Chuck, in, chuck it in for the OzCast uh, network. That helps the podcast out and you get a bit of a discount Mate, as well. it's already cheap anyway. And they're going to get 25 bucks off of their two first boxes. There you go. Infomercial <laughs> over, everybody. Oh, that's crazy. Hey, um, sp- hey you, know what it is? How, you know what we should do? Yeah. Come to my house and we should uh, cook one up. Cook one up. Let's do it. Yeah. yeah. Hey, I've cooked uh, stuff out of a box before. It's called miso soup. <laughs> Can't be that hard. Go. Oh, bit Asian. That's sweet as. Can't wait. Hey, guys, guys, guys. I've got a... Uh... Power quiz. Power quiz, yeah! everybody. <laughs> That was a Benny Hill theme. Damn you. I can't play. You know that I couldn't play that. That was a a jackety sax, isn't it? Absolutely not. Ah, sounded like that. It is uh, standard nondescript music that has no licensing. To be honest, as soon as Andy plays any intro music, I actually whack my pants around and try to chase imaginary (laughs) women in bikinis. Ah, that means that it would have been beach related, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. (laughs) Fellas, are you ready for the power quiz this evening? Yes, we are. Because uh, this one, well... It's, uh, it's going to really make you think. Oh, really? Oh, I've really forward yeah, sold this one. Liam. Fantastic. I, I have failed <laughs> time before, Liam. Fuck all right, off. All right, fellas. So uh, let's get the power quiz started with the first question. What's worse? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what's worse? What's worse? Being handcuffed and having to put your face in a small cage with an angry street cat having free reign oh. to scratch the shit out of your face for three minutes or... Wearing the clothes taken from a dead man for 24 hours. I would definitely go the second one, just saying. Uh, look, I'm going to take the dead man for two reasons. A, cruelty to the cat. Why is it cruel to the fucking cat's allowed to scratch the shit out of yeah, your face? Yeah, but he's in a cage, though. That's, that's oh, wrong. yeah. All right. Okay. Yeah. I'll, I'll um, dead man. <laughs> oh, hang on. <laughs> Further question. Yep. How did the dead man pass away? Uh don't ask questions about the questions. Oh, right. Because I'm thinking, um, we do that already. Because <laughs> I occasionally shop at, uh, you know, second-hand stores yes. that have clothes. Yes. Ah, yeah. I have to occasionally stitch a couple together. Do you so think that there's some size. dead people clothes in there amongst oh, the fuck treasure yeah. trove? Yeah. Oh, I've had to get the stains out. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> That's the thing is you don't know what you're going to get with a dead man's clothes. You're going to take dead man's two, clothes. Two dead men okay. walking. Do I just see a dead guy and then just take it up? Because dead man versus Oh, look, I don't want to go too far into the details. Is, 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 it could be very close. I'm yeah. thinking some deal goes down at a mortuary or a funeral home. and uh, oh, So they died in the clothing? Yeah, they died in the clothing. Okay, okay. Yeah, right. And then you get to wear them for 24 hours. Because <laughs> if it's a suit, right, and they got yeah. stabbed in the chest, well, you don't need this, this shit. Just take the suit. No, you have to wear yeah, the cool. fucking full outfit. Underwear oh, as well, right. mate. Okay. Underwear as well. Underwear as well. Every, well they yeah. definitely yeah. would have Including underwear, themselves. of course. Yeah, yep. including underwear. Can you chuck the nugget out? You... No, well, look, no, no, no. They'll be wearing Depends, wouldn't they? <laughs> what, what that, is it Not always. Depends. Depends. It depends. It depends. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. Oh, man. Yeah, right. That big old man tampon that they wear. So you guys are going to wear the dead man's clothes. Can we Pad. just get confirmation on this, guys? Yeah, we're, the yeah, we're going to wear that. Yeah. What would you do, Liam? Was either get scratched in the face by a pussy or... I think or... I'm going to take the cat. <laughs> <laughs> now, if, you do it, if you're going down on a chick and it's got a tooth in there, don't do it. Don't uh, do it. Don't go down on a pussy that you could do the dishes on. I, I yeah, just can't scarab. wear haunted clothes. I <laughs> uh, can't wear haunted clothes. And I could take the cat scratching as long as it didn't work my eyeballs too hard. How long are you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, they love fucking balls, mate. Uh, would you put your scrotum in instead? 
Oh, over my face? Oh, Jesus. Oh. Um, We're going to notice your face. Yeah, I'll take it on the face. Yeah, I'll take it on yeah, the face. Right. We've got okay. that, we'll that one locked away now. That's what you said last <laughs> night. Hey. 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 All right, everybody. Hey. 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 We're up to our second question for the power quiz. Can't wait. I say, your face looks very smooth. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. You've been Thank scratching you. that shit with the pussy? I'm lubing up no, so no, that the, the scratches... A bit of cream last night. Like a oh. boxer. The, the scratches come off like a... The navy cat. came over. Ah, uh, never mind. Yep. <laughs> All right. Uh, look, well, can, so, can we whack on your face after the cat no, I don't know where that came in, Biggie. <laughs> yeah. That's strange, you? Ah, All it's right. moisturizer. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I need, for this question, I need to set the scene first, okay? Right. So I'm setting the scene. Oh, go, 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 go. Is, it in the, is it in the bush somewhere? <laughs> no, no. We're not in the Amazon. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> now it's not the Wolf Sweet Wall Street. Home. Oh, yeah, okay, never mind. Uh, oh, no, sorry, uh, three uh, people had uh, Vietnam flashbacks. Oh, Jesus yeah, yeah. Christ. All right, can I, can I ask the fucking question? <laughs> I'm trying to that set the scene. A terrible cruise ship. Yeah. <laughs> okay, this challenge, you must lead your normal life, but we're going to set a few little, uh, little milestones in your life for right, this okay, week, right? Fantastic. Yep. So this week, you must visit your parents, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. go to a christening, yep. Yep. and attend work like you normally would for a full week, right? Yeah. Okay. Yep. Okay. Yep. Yeah, no worries. Yeah. Um, all while wearing one of either costume. <coughs> all right. A 70s sequined roller skating outfit or a full lycra skin tight Satan outfit with a trident and you cannot explain why and you have to attend all of these events. <laughs> you have to attend your parents' house, a christening and your work and you can't explain why. Sequent roller skates cannot take them off for the full week. Yeah. Or a oh. Satan outfit with a trident. Lycra skin tight Satan outfit. I, I, I really just went straight for the, 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 the Satan outfit. So I actually so you would yeah. turn up to a church at a child's christening yeah. in a Satan outfit. So, 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 yeah, absolutely. All right. Okay. Yeah. That's cool. I have no bothers with that whatsoever. Very good. Yes. I like okay. I, I've got a few issues. <laughs> <laughs> um, I do not want to do the devil's thing. No. So, you know, I believe in God. Right. Should a grown man wearing roller skates and a sequined <laughs> outfit be at a christening either? <laughs> Check, mate. <my> yes. <laughs> <laughs> because God forgives all. <laughs> No, according to that, uh, the, 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 the Walls Brother or whatever the fuck it's called, church in America. Oh, uh, Westboro Baptist yeah, that, that's Church. That's it. Big shout out to those oh, guys. Yeah, right. and thanks for sponsoring this episode. And that's, uh, <laughs> you're part of that, are you? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> they have really colourful signs. Well, all of a sudden, you've lost all your 32 likes on your yeah. Facebook page. And I've gained a thousand, thanks we to Louis to Thoreau. All that. all that shit. Now, I can't um, miss all this out, so that's good. It's very no, good. no, no, no. I, I would, I don't know. I reckon I'm going to look bad in both. Yeah, of so course. That's the whole idea. If I'm going to look bad, make it fabulous. <laughs> All right. Sequence. <laughs> sequence skating. So you'll be, you'll be going into your work around the cubicles, skating around. Spirit as you, fingers as you and all. Fantastic. Oh, mate, I'm going to skate up for communion. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Oh, and Andy then. is going to be Satan. Yeah. All right, fellas. we got one more question for the power quiz. Yeah. yeah. Cool. yeah your, your answers have been amazing so Thank far. Thank you, sir. Um, one more question. Very yeah. short, sharp, and shiny. Yes. Would you rather get uglier or dumber? Well, um, you know, as I get older, I feel like I'm doing both anyway. Yeah. <laughs> so if I had the choice, it'd be a blessing. Yeah. Um, <laughs> oh, I don't know. Um, I reckon dumber mm. because... Um, You'd still get fucked. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Cool. yeah you know yeah. what I mean? Yep. Yep. Yeah. yeah. But if you're smarter, but you just go, yeah, God, what the fuck is that? Look at this fucker. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Ah, but I can do your taxes. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, with <laughs> just one tooth hanging out <laughs> below your knees. Yeah, fuckers cringing as you walk past yes, and stuff. Exactly. Oh, look so, at that guy. Yeah, I'd rather get, because, uh, well, it has to be a development than what I've already got, right? I guess so. <laughs> Yeah, you don't get... Yeah. yeah. You go worse than what okay, you are. So what I'm saying, okay, is I don't get any bolder. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Brilliant. Lock yeah. me in, Eddie. <laughs> ba, ba, da, ba. <laughs> yeah, you, Ando? I reckon definitely the dumber. You got De- dumber. Definitely the dumber. You yeah. want to go dumber? Oh, yeah, because yeah. you're, you're already fucking good looking. <laughs> Stop it. Uh, no, I'm not. Fucking hell. Uh, yeah, but you live. Why don't you fuck him? 
Well, you know, he tried, but Yasmin wouldn't let me. Oh, well. Me, oh, yeah, I'm going to go dumber as well because ignorance is fucking bliss, man. And, oh, yeah, yeah. People will be like, you know, staring at you if you're real ugly and you're smart enough to realize it. Yeah. But if you're dumb as dog shit, you don't care. And then. Isn't that called dementia? Yeah. yeah. That's basically that's what's happening. I guess, yeah, that's what's happening yeah. in the future. Yep. A lot uh, of people will forget about it anyway. Yeah. <laughs> that was good. Like that. Well, we're going to have to catch you guys next week because we're all really tucking out. We are, but oh, before we go, I just want to say Vale John Clark. Yes. Uh, who yes. is a, a Australian uh, satirist. Uh, uh, sorry. <laughs> yeah, what was it, mate? Uh, 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 vale John Clark, who was an awesome comedian and uh, um, a, a New Zealand guy as yeah. well. So, um, he, yeah, I remember watching him uh, do his shows. Um, for the year. current affair. That's and, right. For yeah. years as a kid, I'm before, you know, as a kid, you don't even know what the hell they're talking about exactly yeah. and then as you get a bit older you, you know it seems like he was there forever doesn't it didn't it so yeah. uh, now yeah there's if, if you want to see an awesome tribute definitely head into the weekly and see uh charlie pickering and tom gleason uh actually do an awesome uh tribute to john clark it's definitely awesome see i saw them do it and i was like oh man they're taking off john clark before i knew that he'd passed away and yeah, i was like right. fuck uh, yeah, I felt bad that day. But a fantastic, <laughs> what a fantastic show. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, so definitely the, the Weekly, who's hosted by uh, Charlie Pickering and, and Tom Gleeson, check it out. It, it's on YouTube, uh, Facebook, the whole works. Uh, definitely check out the, their John Clark tribute for sure. Very cool. good. Check us out on Facebook, facebook.com forward slash the Badcast podcast. Twitter as well, the uh, underscore Badcast. Instagram, the Badcast. Don't forget Ozcast as well, our network, uh, f- uh, facebook.com forward slash Ozcast Network, A U S C A S T. There you go, guys. I think I spelled it right. No, no, it's fantastic. <laughs> Jeez, I got a stitch listening to that. To be honest, uh, <laughs> tell you, I didn't breathe that whole time. Oh, I could. Oh, if I did, I'd fucking pass out and knock my head out. Oh, you poor buddy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See you next time, fellas. Help us buy more beers and sponsor us. Hit us up on Facebook, Twitter, or badcast.com.au. The Badcast is part of the Ozcast Podcast Network. Love this podcast? Support it and sponsor today. Simply head to OzcastNetwork.com for details.